Reiki Distance Healing Maybe you have heard of distance healing or are exploring other styles of Reiki. In this video, we take a closer look at Reiki distance healing, the benefits and what you can expect from the practice. What is distant Reiki? Distant Reiki is, as the name implies, the process of using Reiki healing across distances and time itself. This is normal behavior for energy, which already travels to function. Energy doesn't work unless it's moving, so it would be strange if Reiki didn't operate at a distance, as long as practitioners meet the conditions for use. The primary purpose of distant Reiki is providing healing energy to people who cannot receive it through direct contact. The Benefits of Distance Healing The main advantages of distance healing are a sense of relaxation, a feeling of fulfillment and improvements to natural healing rates. Distant Reiki is not a substitute for other medical treatments and cannot, for example, heal a broken arm in a single session. If it could, they'd never stop talking about it on the news. Instead, distant Reiki is a way to exchange energy and allow it to flow, encouraging the natural healing energies of the recipient's body to start working better than before. This process is particularly helpful when working with clients who are far away from regular Reiki clinics and facilities. In the internet age, distant Reiki is also a way for people who have only met online to share the healing benefits of Reiki. Tips for the Distance Reiki Practitioner The first thing to remember about performing Reiki at a distance is that it is not fundamentally harder, more complicated or more advanced than using Reiki in person. When electricity moves down a wire, it is practically instantaneous whether the cable is going across the room or across a continent. Energy functions in predictable ways. We may not understand the rules at first, but once we know them, we can start to control that energy. That said, it helps if you talk with your client while focusing on your intent and being extremely specific about how you intend to focus your healing. Tips for the Distance Reiki Client Being the recipient of distant Reiki healing can seem strange at first, and you may even find yourself wondering if it's working. This is an entirely normal reaction. After all, when we enable the Wi-Fi in buildings, we can't sense that connection even when we know it's there. We have to rely on special tools to tell us that the Wi-Fi exists in that area, and we can only see it working when our mobile devices function properly. There's an old saying for this, the absence of evidence is not evidence of absence. This means that the mere fact that you can't tell if something is there or not has no impact whatsoever on its existence. It's okay to have questions and be doubtful. However, do your best to be receptive and follow your practitioner's instructions while seeking healing. Methods of Distance Reiki Healing Methods of Distance Reiki Healing vary by user. However, most people find that distant healing works best when using a focus of some type that can help both the practitioner and client attune to each other. Like using a metronome to set time, focuses can help attune the healing energies and maximize their effectiveness. If the practitioner and client are too out of sync, Reiki will not work. This too is predictable and normal. If a plug cannot fit a socket, there's no way to draw energy through it. The same principles that govern all energy apply to Reiki. Don't be afraid to experiment with different tools to find out what works best. Just remember to be honest and upfront with clients when testing things. New to Reiki? Check out the link below in the description where you learn some of the most powerful and effective Reiki healing technique in the world. These techniques are not only extremely effective, but they're also super simple and easy to master. For more Reiki tips and guide, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel.